What's up everyone, Azurakamas here and today I'm going to present you my brand new car game called Naga, as you can see right here. Here is my player's playmat, but I will explain it in another video. So let's start off with uh, the Bleu Bleu. I will say the name in French, but I will translate them later. So here is the Bleu Bleu, uh, a basic card. You can have it in any deck, in any water deck or multi-element deck. Then we've got uh, the Dragon Elect like Scan, which is also a water creature. Level 1 as well. Pretty simple and pretty cool. Here we've got uh, the uh, Water Spirit. Actually, this means uh, Blue Blob and uh, and uh, Waterful uh, Dragon. So here is the Water Spirit. 3 uh, three life but 7 attack, so it's quite. Um, for an offensive deck, it's quite good. Uh, it comes from the, um, the Spirit Archetype. There are a lot, a lot of archetypes in that game, but I'll talk about it in another video. Then you've got the harpoon, the harpoon shark, which is a four six level two. Good, the good card. I'll keep it in my deck for my water deck. Here is Morgan, my, my one of my favorite cards, like uh, the Pleius, right here. Here is the ocean devourer, which has a good effect. Uh, that means that once per turn you can destroy as many water uh, mana as you want and you can uh, reduce the attack of another monster on the field by this uh, by this number so if I have uh, like two uh, like three I mean water mana I can uh, destroy them and reduce the attack of the of the harpoon uh, shark by three so it will be at uh, at three so that this is quite good to uh, to lead uh, the game. Then you have a uh, Rao This is uh, this is uh, also a good creature, and it uh, changes its ele its uh, elements. It on the, uh, I mean, you attack a creature, and this card will take this element. But if you if you want to take this element, you can, but you are not forced to. Then for fire creatures, you have the blue, you have the red blue blob, sorry. Fire spirit, Nuflik, which is uh, the card with the highest uh, amount of life in this game. And then for the air creature, you have the white blob. Here is a, a air and water creature. That means that you can summon it with either water or air manas but you can also use both then the air spirit and uh, the genie donut I don't really know how to translate it pro properly but in the final game you will have it uh, I've got then for the earth creatures you have the brown blob Marduk Young Black Fang a dark thing, I mean, sorry. I don't really know how I'm going to translate for the final game, but uh, we'll see. Then, for the. Then you have the poison rat, the earth spirit, the ramikas, which is a pun between the rat and kamikas. I don't. Yes, it works in English as well. So that's good. Then, random thing with a hat. Zilla Dark Fang, Ria Dark Fang Prince, and now for equipment, you have the uh, hero element, the hero amulet. I mean, that applies for uh, Dark Fangs. Here you have uh, Ida's Blade, that applies to any any kind of creature, and then for the field you have the the Dark Fang Lair. So. That's all the card I made so far, and uh, that's it for today. Hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, tell me if you want to see more of this card game or if it interests you. I think uh, not really soon, but I will be posting the the rules for this card game, and I hope you enjoyed it. Bye.